I wanna talk a little bit about people who have healthy internal boundaries versus people who do not. And this is actually a quote from Pia Melody in her book, Breaking Free, which is a really good resource for those of you starting out on your codependency recovery journey. So Pia Melody says, and this one really hits close to home for me, people who have healthy internal boundaries know that they are responsible for what they think, feel, and do, and that no one else makes them think, feel, or do anything. On the other hand, people with impaired internal boundaries blame others for what they think, feel, or do, and often inappropriately take responsibility for the thoughts, feelings, and behaviors of others. So let that one sink in and start to think about, okay, am I somebody who has healthy internal boundaries or am I somebody who has impaired internal boundaries? And by the way, this can look different in different relationships. So you might have healthier boundaries at work and less healthy boundaries, let's say with parents or with kids or with partner or whatever, right? It doesn't have to look the same across the board. But the couple really important um, components in this quote for me that I like to always highlight when I'm working with people around boundaries is that this idea that no one else is responsible for how you think, feel, and, and act, right? No one can make you think or feel or do something. They can definitely trigger a response. They might, they might start off or initiate that response, but nobody can actually make you feel a certain way. This is a really kind of confusing, sometimes I think even to me, thing to understand, but I think it's really important for us to start taking the responsibility around, I feel hurt. I feel pissed. I feel, you know, um, not listened to. I feel disregarded. I feel, um, you know, disrespected. Whatever the feeling is, is valid. And it might be attached to that person and their behavior, but they can't make you feel a certain way. And so what that does, I don't think that's a victim blaming thing. I think for me, that was really helpful in understanding my part in something and owning it and depersonalizing it, right? Like this person definitely brought this response out in me, but how I decided to respond in kind is actually on me. That's my ownership to take.